from this cutting, I have got this three quarter bat and a quarter bat. Now, in this bonding, I am going to use only this three quarter bat. Then you check the vertical marking. Is it to be seven? Since the brick is six centimeter height and, and the joint is one centimeter. Now the marking height should be seven centimeters. That is red. It is time to check the verticality or the plumbiness of my wall. And the spirit level is touching the, the first brick and the second. This lid is ready. Then I go to the second lid on the other side. Once the, the bubble is centered, now the one lead to the other, we have just a, a level, a, the horizontality. Now, we check the other, the other brick butt. Since two, two reeds are ready, now I can feel the intermediate brick. Remember that we are doing the stretcher course. Now the second course is ready. Now we, pre we remove this excess, excess motor.
we keep a bit distance, then we look if the joint are regular. If we have just kept, kept the regular joint. Since the joint are regular, we remove our string, we go for the third, the third course. The bubble is centered, the top of the brick is centered, We have the end centered, is vertical, then we go to the other lid. We check if two ends or two leads are on the same horizontal level. As you see, the bubble is centered. Okay? Everything is okay with these two leads. Now I'm going to fill this gap with the intermediate bricks. Remember to keep the string. So as we end the task, the task is, which was given was to perform a screen wall just with, the, with a given length, 1.7 meter, and the height was six cores.
Now I am at the end of this task. See, you see we have first, second, third, cost number four, five, six. And the length is 1.7. Then I am going to clean the, my workpiece. I remove the excess, excess of mortar in the joint. I clean the area. Then I clean my tools. Later on, they will be returned in our main store. So now I'm going to the process of cleaning. Then as my workpiece is cleaned, I have cleaned also the working area, then I go to the process of cleaning my tools. So dear all, as we come to the end of our class, I would like to take this opportunity to thank everybody who have followed my class. And uh, I encourage you to repeat and to revise either in a class or on site using different tools like uh, bricks. And you revise your notes. And I will take this opportunity to welcome you in the next class in the masonry. Thank you a lot. Bye.